what are our patients' needs? Up to 50% of all cases of dementia could potentially be dampened by earlier medical and behavioral interventions due to the complexity of causes leading to Alzheimer-like type dementia. A premise for such approach is that our patients need to be informed about their potential risk and novel drugs could be investigated in clinical trials much earlier before structural changes occur. Today, you are used to be informed by your doctor about your preventive cancer screening test results, for example, to prevent cervix or prostate cancer. In the same way, we wish in the future to be able to offer a brain health screening method for our aging population. What are the clinical needs? Today, clinicians do not have globally access to simple, affordable, non-invasive dementia screening methods. When they are diagnosing their patients, it is already too late. What is the AR-MIND solution? We will introduce an empowered EEG technology using supercomputer power and mathematics to inform us about functional brain network changes due to such possible logical aging. We believe that such functional brain network changes are the first signs of cognitive changes long time before structural classical dementia changes will be discoverable. The data on functional brain networks, along with other known markers for dementia, will be fed into a predictive artificial intelligence-based model to provide us with results on an individual dementia risk profile. Why AI-MIND's outcome is so important? We are all experiencing the limiting impact on our social lives and our economy by COVID pandemic. But in fact, we have been and will harbor an even bigger pandemic during the next decades. We are counting already 50 million dementia subjects worldwide, and this number will double during the next 20 years. We know that dementia has a huge burden on patients their families and societies. Therefore, by developing new risk screening methods, identifying new medical and personal interventions, it will be of utterly significance to reach efficiently and help those people who are not diagnosed with dementia, but who are at risk and to prevent or to dampen their cognitive decline. Globally, Alzheimer's disease is the most common form of dementia. If we do not enhance research and innovation like the AI Mind project, the road to have accurate tools potentially helping to prevent and modify the development of dementia will be much longer. Participation in the AI Mind offer the opportunities to strengthen better understanding of the impact and the trustworthiness of AI driven diagnostics. On behalf of the Norwegian Health Association, I think it is crucial to contribute to this kind of research. It is especially relevant as it focuses on new diagnostic methods related to the prognosis and the development of Alzheimer's disease. Bringing up this kind of evidence is key for worldwide policymaking. It will allow immediate action that might have a great effect on the future incidents of dementia.